I think Freeze is a great fair to discover new things and to present ideas. We believe that we, um, we have brought very strong works. London is a major, major place for contemporary and international art. Yeah, it just looks good, it looks modern. It gives us the opportunity to show what we're doing. The gallery opened in 1993 um, with a group of um, six or seven Danish artists we started representing. Slowly it, it grew and, and, and the group of artists we represented has been growing with us. What we have been doing since the very beginning of the gallery has been to introduce different aspects of art to the Danish scene. And we believe that we, um, we have brought very strong works, uh, which is very important for us when we take part in this uh, important fair. This fair is, is one of the very most important fairs uh, in the world. Well, we've all, we started out in Soho in the early 90s. We've always represented many European artists and a group of artists from the West Coast, from Los Angeles. We've moved to Chelsea, we've expanded our space in Chelsea a great deal. And we've taken on artists at different moments in their careers. It's a wide range of artists living all over the world, working in all kinds of media, with an emphasis on figurative painting and minimalism. We have what is considered to be a very strong program, uh, and we also have a very long commitment to our artists. We don't let go of artists the moment their work doesn't sell, which many other galleries do. We have a very big staff. David is a very good boss, you know, he treats his staff really well. So I think it's all these things, and then of course we have an amazing space, if I may say so myself, in, uh, in New York. So it's. I think there's many different factors that contribute to that success. I think there's something incredibly special about making that first exhibition with an artist. It really creates a bond and a level of trust. And ultimately, that is what the gallery is. It's relationships with the artist. This is an artist that only started working with the gallery about a year ago. And I felt that one of the best ways to start was to plan to do an exhibition in two cities simultaneously, here in London and in New York. This freeze we've chosen to really highlight perhaps some of the younger artists on the roster, artists like My Two Clarets, Jessica Jackson Hutchins. We're highlighting artists with whom we'll have shows coming up. It's a very useful way of in a way, getting into conversation with um, collectors and press and curators about our future programme. We've over started uh, almost four years ago. My partner in the gallery, who's also an artist represented by us, and uh, I met in the Buenos Aires Art Fair and decided that we should do it just for the fun of it and also because we thought that Peruvian artists were not being well represented. The art scene in Peru is uh, growing a lot, especially because uh, Peru is doing a lot better economically, and so people are starting to have more interest in art. My expectations for the fair this year is we will have success communicating our artworks, selling the works of course, meeting important collectors and curators and press. That's why we enjoy coming back and, and, um, and being part of this uh, great event.